Hey guys, another little quick video from Sam series again. Uh, just something I've been thinking about recently. A lot of uh, devs uh, releasing games that aren't really finished. And we have to buy, obviously, the rest of the game as it comes. Now, I get that next-gen games, you know, they have aspiring ideas that maybe pan out a lot. Or maybe when you actually buy a game, it's a full game in their eyes realistically you know we are having to pay a lot more money to get what was originally intended for the game i mean elder scrolls online you know we all thought it was going to be everywhere no we actually have to pay for that right um also destiny the big one as we've already explained in one of my previous videos um you know people that have actually paid full price are getting screwed on the price factor nothing really to show their loyalty but it's just one of those really irksome things that is really frustrating to me. At the end of the day, how come we're not getting value for money anymore? I mean, the game's costing, what, 50 quid? And we're not even getting a full game anymore. I mean, don't get me wrong, they're fantastic games, but, I mean, why should we have to pay through the nose for the extras? Uh, when it really should have been part of the full game in the first place, anyway. It was just something on my mind. I'd love to know your opinions on the uh, subject. Uh, you know, feel free to like, subscribe. Continue watching. Thanks for watching Sam series. Good night.